Hi, in this video I'm going to show you how you can uh, intersect two roofs in ARCHICAD. So let's say we have a situation like this, where I have a bigger roof, which in reality this is composed out of two roof elements, as you can see, so one and two. And I want to intersect this big roof with this smaller one. This is also composed out of two roof elements as you can see. The point is that I don't want to have this material here and I don't want to have this access material here. And also if we go in a 2D view these two intersection lines are not visible. This one and this one. So let's go into 2D view. As you can see those two lines are not at all visible because in reality the intersection is not really created. So in order to do that, I'm going to work mainly in my 2D view. What I'm going to do is I'm going to select this roof and this upper right point. We know that these three points are approximately in the right direction. This is the one that has to go downwards. I'm going to bring it down a little bit. You don't know how much because that's what we're trying to obtain, the intersection line. And also here, I'm going to bring this down. Once I've done that, I'm going to select this bigger part of the bigger roof and I'm going to create here kind of a V-shape. So I'm going to create a new knot here. I'm going to create a new knot here and one over here. Once we've done that, we can see that we have the basic V-shape that we're going to have, but it's not really the final one. In order to achieve the correct intersection lines, I'm going to click on this small roof and then I'm going to hold down my control button and I'm going to click on this edge, which is the edge with which I want to intersect my roof. So I'm holding down the control button and clicking here. As you can see, the intersection line is now created. In the same way, I'm going to hold down this bigger roof and I'm gonna click on this edge because I want this small roof to intersect with this edge and I clicked on that and as you can see now the intersection line is correct let's go in our 3d view and see what we have so far as you can see this intersection is generated correctly and this is the remaining part that we're gonna do in just a few seconds so I'm going to go back in my 2D view, I'm going to select this roof, and then I'm going to hold down my control button, and I'm going to click on this edge of the bigger roof. And as you can see, we already have generated the intersection line. Once I did that, I'm going to once again select the big roof, hold down the control button on this edge of the smaller roof. So if you go back in the 3D view, we can see now that the intersection is correct. We don't have access material here, and we don't have access material here. The intersection is done cleanly and correctly. Okay, I hope this helps. Thank you for watching. Bye!